like I said, I mean, yeah, a safety vest may be a little bit too big for me, uh, but it, it never crossed my mind of the comfortability for women when it comes to personal protective equipment. And so she told me about you, and that's one of the ways we got in contact. What are some of the things that you all are doing to help women in regards to personal protective equipment? Well, we started, um, it, it piqued our interest because we were doing a, a trade show um, several years back, gotta be good seven, eight years ago. And a couple of women came up to us, they announced that they worked for Harley Davidson on one of their production lines. Mm -hmm. And they were like, you got to make stuff for women. And we're like, what do you mean? And they explained to us that on the production line, they're required to wear high visibility. You know, there's a lot of equipment around. And you got to be able to be seen. And, you know, it could be forklifts coming by, you know, and all that kind of stuff and robotics. And so it makes sense to wear high visibility, even indoors in that situation. But they were wearing male high visibility. It didn't fit right. Uh, it was generally too baggy and they could get caught up in the motorcycles as they came by or the machinery they used to, you know, um, apply pieces to the bike as it came down the assembly line. And the woman said that we might, we might as well have been wearing all black and not be seen mm. at all. And we would have felt safer if the clothing fit right. So that got our wheels spinning uh, initially. That was the initial, I guess you'd say, inspiration for us to get involved with women's high visibility. And so, what we did and what we do in general is we have an in-house designer who's been designing clothing for over 20 years uh, mm -hmm. irrespective of the type of clothing he knows how to design clothing he understands the um, variety of fits and how to design things to to fit different body shapes so mm -hmm. obviously with a woman um, women have different chests than we do mm -hmm. and you have to accommodate that and create the room for that Mm -hmm. But women also might have, let's say, they might be a, a larger than average chest, but with a smaller than average hip. So you got to be able to accommodate the both. So in, mm -hmm. the, in our case with a vest, we have an inner drawstring mm -hmm. that a woman could use in that particular body situation so that it draws the vest a little tighter around their hip. Because let's say they, they're, they're really maybe a, a ladies medium, but they buy a ladies large to accommodate their chest and shoulders. But then down below here, as you get closer to the waistline, there's too much baggy, you know, going on. Mm -hmm. So they mm -hmm. pull that drawstring and all of a sudden they've got a good fit. So, right. You know, that's one thing right there. And we kind of do that across the board with our, our outerwear. You know, we've got a couple of soft shells, um, a full zip and a quarter zip pullover. Um, a woman's parka that has an elastic gathering in the back, um, again, to accommodate some of the range of of shall we say hips and waists you mm -hmm. know that that a lady can have um mm -hmm. and um and we have a, and we also have a lady's raincoat um rain jacket kind of the same way so um just first an understanding that there are differences you don't need an armhole and a and a width of an arm to be as big as it is for a male mm -hmm. you don't need a, a woman doesn't need to be swimming inside that right so everything is is in proportion to that and um and, and, you know, mo the other manufacturers that are out there doing doing these things um, understand that, too, for the most part now and are uh, uh, keen on that. Uh, what we're keen on, really, is providing more choices for women. Mm -hmm. um, because if you open up any catalog, uh, women's high-vis products usually are an oh-by-the-way product. Oh, by the way, we've got this. Right. It, it's not... We have high visibility for male and females. Right. And the, when you hear, oh, by the way, or you hear, we also have, that's an afterthought, mm -hmm. you know? And in this age of, you know, of, of, uh, of equity and mm -hmm. inclusion, um, oh, by the way, isn't going to cut it. Right. You know, so we, we, we look at it differently. We have these six pieces. We have uh, a long sleeve tee. We have a short sleeve tee now. We're going to have a long sleeve tee. We're going to have a rain pant. Eventually, we're going to have a zip-up hoodie and then probably a bomber jacket. We want to get to the place where um, a woman says, um, you know, or a crew, you know, of women say, I can find what I want here. You know, right. you can get your T-shirt, you can get your jacket, you can get your sweatshirt, you can get your rain jacket all in one spot and not have to cherry pick around five different manufacturers to find what they're looking for because men don't have to do that.